I wasn't even listening to it in the car, I was listening to Spanish music. <laughs> Despacito. I feel like it looks cute just like in the high ponytail, but that's, the, that's what I said. I was like, do I want to recurl it? Mm -hmm. Do I want to leave it? Because I'm going to get drunk and not really care anyway. I was feeling white. I wanted to get white and red. Okay, I'm so hungry. I had to dig in. But yeah. then um, I saw the white girl rosé and I was like, I have to get it. Totally a right. Sam kind of thing. I feel like this isn't like a formal hey guys video, but I feel like I should say it anyway. Hey guys, we'd share our girl thoughts with you, but there's not enough. <laughs> Alright guys, so today's video is a little bit different, and I'm super excited about it. I asked some of you in my other video if you wanted to see a drunk makeup challenge where I get drunk and try to do my makeup because now I am 21, and a few of you said I should do it. Our friend Katie said that I should do it with Deb, and we thought it was yep. like a really good idea to do it together since yes. we're both 21 now. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, we also just decided to like make it into a collab and do a video on Deb's channel too. Mm -hmm. So I will leave the link to her channel as well as her video and a little iCard popping up and somewhere right vlog here. Vlog exception. <laughs> Deb is vlogging too, so that video will be yes. up. So we're just gonna okay. dig into some pizza and garlic knots. We have Chianti for Deborah and my. White Girl Rosé. First we are going to have a Sprite and some raspberry vodka literally filled to the top. Um, if anybody knows me personally, you know that I am a slow drinker and a slow eater. It takes a really long time for me to eat um, and a really long time for me to get drunk. Um, so this I should be interesting. Wine drunk quick. Also, got to shout out Samantha. So she gave these to me years ago. They are wine glasses with lipstick and kisses on them. I thought that was very fitting for the video. So we're just going to dig in. There's definitely like noodles in there. Yeah, but it's not ramen. Say it was almost 11. Get drunk because I'm drunk. I'm feeling it. Okay. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? Are you feeling it? Did he paint that himself? It's not Picasso, oh but I don't know. Maybe. That's pretty good. That actually is very accurate. Please make me understand. What did you do? I don't know. 
the door because I thought it was How open. How drunk are you? I thought it was open enough. Drunk enough for this video. I'm like, I'm gonna it's keep hitting me slowly. I'm going to keep the straw in there. <laughs> it looks good. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, we're filming. We're filming. Um, okay. I think. Yes, it's going. Okay. Let's get ready to party. I'm excited and I feel relaxed and I'm ready to party. I'm a slow drinker. It's hitting me, but slowly. Deb's way more drunk than me, but that's fine because I feel good. That's the most important part. Um, my skin hates me. My eyebrows need to be done, so we're just going to ignore that. I dyed my eyebrows, but they still you need to colored. be colored. I'm not going to be priming it. So I'm okay. just taking BB cream. I kept the straw in my cup because I look cute. I'm going to take this whole bag out. Oh, it is cold. Okay, I have the... Get Primed by Femme Couture. Looks like a giant glue stick. Tati does not like it. I do. Oh my god, I have no nose ring in. This is weird. Really? Yeah. So it does feel like a glue stick and it says that you have to apply your foundation like immediately after. So we're going to rub it in pretty quick. Are you quick. using primer? Yes, this is called the Get Primed. Why? I don't know, I just feel like my pores, even Makes though I really don't have it. any. Dream Liquid Mousse in number 70 because I'm tan with Dream Fresh BB in medium deep. Mix it together. And I used the Maybelline BB cream, now I'm just using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Oh, oh my god, I feel like we're Desi and Katie and you're moving really quick and I'm going so slow. <laughs> oh, I just regretted my life decision. Feels like you're punching your face right now. Like I can hear it. Now you definitely sound like uh, like Desi. I don't have contour. Do you have contour with you? I have butter bronzer. Okay, I have bronzer bronzer. You don't contour with bronzer? Mm. Sometimes, but I'm going for that real bronze look. I don't know what I'm going for right now. Oh man. I honestly feel too light. I feel like I need to mix in more. Okay, I'm gonna take the physician's formula. Wake up, you're sleeping. Face powder. <laughs> no, that just he's nasty. <laughs> All right, this isn't helping. I'm too tan at this point. Great. Just bronze it up. I will. <gasps> I didn't bring makeup wipes. I got you. Okay. Why do you need makeup wipes? For later, because I just put it all over my hands. Oh. I usually have my makeup blankie. Me and Sam have makeup blankies. She has hers. I did not bring mine. Oh, I, know. Is, I gotta wear the straight torch one. It is sitting at home on my vanity. Revlon Photo Ready Face Powder in the shade 10 Fair Light underneath the eyes. LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Natural. I don't know why I'm like Speedy Gonzalez over here. I'm Maybe because you didn't prime, so you went right into it. I primed. Butter bronzer, Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. Blend that with the Beauty Blender. We're doing our makeup as if we were going out tonight. Cause we are. Cause we totally are. That Uber is coming in like an hour, so we gotta be ready. Okay, now I'm doing face powder. I have to catch up with her. No, Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder for under my eyeballs. I have yet to use a makeup brush, so you guys are going to see me use this. This is the City Color Bronzer in Sunrise. Everybody knows I use this in like everything. My yeah. face always stays the same. It's a clean up on her like, contour. I'm going to prime the eyes with my NYX <gasps> Conceal Correct Contour. It's like a cream. There's like a contour. Do you want to use a cream contour? Oh, yeah, because I didn't set the rest of my face yet. Hold on, wine break. I almost put this on under my eyes. <laughs> After I just set my eyes. Can you imagine? Oh, wait, you wanted to give me my present. Oh, on biscuits. On film. Hold up. Why isn't it saying now? Okay. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Did you just fart? Quick intermission. No, that was a little bad. I just, uh, I mean, I wasn't going to judge, but I was like, wow. Oh, no, I usually know. Wait, I just got to set my eyes real quick. Okay. So she... I'm using the Tardis Pro Palette. I'm taking the color classic. 
I'm not kidding. This actually this is the only Tarte thing I own. And the shadows are amazing. I, no, but honestly, now I see why everybody wants to trip with Tarte because we want they have great products. I they do. I just I just started stuff. getting into them again too. I'm using Sam's concealer palette for this like dark contour shade because I didn't bring one. Okay, and definitely open my gift. Oh, Lord. Makeup Revolution. Ooh. Ooh. I have only tried one thing from them, and I really liked it, but I saw this palette, and I thought, I don't think Sam has anything from it, so I'm no. going to it for her. How many colors is it? 16 or 24? 32. Oh, 32 eyeshadows. And they have more wrapping. I'm not mad at this. This is the Ultra Eyeshadow Flawless Palette. Whoa! Oh, girl. <gasps> Ooh, those are very pretty. I've heard great things about their eyeshadow palettes. I've only tried the face highlighters, and I really like them. So, I you decided know, to pick that up for her. I was debating... Maybe a transition shade or something? No, I was there? debating on doing a pink look or a green look. I think I'm going to use all these and do a pink look Like right a now. burgundy? Because I have this really obnoxious, like, This is the Mary Kay face powder. Liquid lippy. Oh, in beige 1.5. So I'm gonna go in, the, in with the color Universal and wait, they have color names. Yeah, that's what this is actually. Oh. Pink. And I'm just gonna like really buff this like all over, and then I'm gonna take that color Universal and focus it more like directly in the crease. Before I asked what MC Hammer's name was, I was like, "What's Hammer Time?" Sam, Sam's like Hammer Time, and then she's like, "Wait, MC Hammer." Yeah, we really just thought his name was Hammer. Because he was. Commercial, so we were like, hammer time. and they didn't play Hammer Time in the commercial. I was a little disappointed. Yeah, but okay, eyebrow time. Hammer time. Anastasia dark brown powder with a Sonia Kashuk brush. Not. I don't even know. I oh, too much. <laughs> Boy, too much. I brought my blending brush. Now I'm taking the color Red Night, and I'm just like really packing it on my eyeball. I really thought you were going to say Redneck. Ooh. That seems time consuming. Are they good? Oh, wow. That is pigmented. These brows are a little deep. That's okay. Big brows are in. Big brows and big butt. Wow. I really want to know if like I was going out tonight and like this is good, but I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. I definitely am not drunk, but I feel buzzed, so. There's a lady leg lamp on the floor. Yes, it's from the Christmas story. Ah, fragile. It must be Italian. I'm gonna take the color glam. Wait, and Sam, put that look at my camera. Inner corner. Why do we look so pale? Because it's really close. I'm gonna do bronzer next. I'm gonna do eyes last today. Hourglass Luminous Bronze Light. I think I need to pick up the darker ones. I heard they just came out with new colors. This is very expensive, but it's bougie and it's good. So for underneath my eyes, I kind of do want to use a green. And I'm gonna go in with Trendy from Tarte because it's darker. And line my lower lash line with it. How much bronzer is too much? Don't question. Okay, I think we're good with bronzer. I'm gonna put it down. For blush, we have one by City Color. I got it at Five Below. Fresh Melon color. Well now I'm going to go in with the green from this palette and it's called Green Stars. Okay so they're green. And I'm going to buff it out with that. I've been loving these Wet n Wild brushes. I find mine at the dollar store you guys. I think they're about two three dollars in like Walgreens but I found them at the Dollar Tree. I was watching Jersey Shore reruns today and Dina had like way too much blush on. Now I'm feeling like her. Maybe they all did their makeup drunk. I actually like it. Actually, no, it actually looks pretty good, I think. For highlight, I'm using the Smashbox palette with Casey Holmes. This is the Spotlight palette in pearl. Can Do you I have use it? That? You no, can use it. I love Casey okay, Holmes. Okay, you can use it. Absolutely. This is pearl. The other one was a little too golden, but now that I'm tanner, I can probably get it. But I got pearl, and I have this e.l.f. highlighting brush. It is so good. I love it. And the third shade has the most glitter in it. The first two are more like pearly, so I'm going to go with the third shade. We're going to really amp it up. Tap it off because this is pigmented. Dude, oh my god. <laughs> I see this in the camera. Oh, these are good, you guys. Oh no. <laughs> I fudged that. I definitely fudged that. 
too much right there. Oh, if it's too much, you you go in with your damp beauty blender on the side that you use your foundation. With your damp beauty blender. Damp, not damp. Now we're gonna do eyes, I guess. So I have a goodie, but an oldie. This is the Lorac Pro Palette, the original one. It's so good, you guys. The whole top row is matte, and the whole bottom row is shimmers. I did bring tape today, but we are going to kind of create the look of tape. So we're gonna start off with using this Wet n Wild brush, and I don't even know what this one's called, but it's just a little like blending brush. It's bomb. And we're going in the, with the shade Cream. It's like a barely there color. And then I'm going in with the shade Taupe, same brush. Gonna define that crease. Ding. Oh, it's a felt pen. I love felt pens. I haven't used one of these since high school, though. I'm not gonna lie. I know you really like that Maybelline one. We're gonna go to the shade mauve. 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 I don't know. I even know how I say it. With my eyebrow brush because it has that like sharp edge. I think I'm gonna go for that real Jersey Shore look into a really smoky eye. We're gonna do it. Okay, we're doing it. I'm going to go with the shade Espresso. Very dark with a Sigma E25. Tap that off. We're going in. Ooh, we're going in. Okay. So we've really smoked out that crease. Let's go in with the shade Gold. I'm just going to use my... I'm going to use a flat brush. I'm going to pack that on. That's pretty highlight though it's i'm telling you the third one in the palette bomb all right we're still we're good we're in frame oh <laughs> my leg just cramped up oh no so this is the nyx suede nyx liquid suede cream lipstick in the color lace of beach i'm putting it on now because it's obnoxious but Whoa. it's gorgeous so i have to let it dry so i can put a nude over it after that's pretty we're doing our drunk makeup tutorial. I'm going for that Jersey Shore look tonight. That's what I put it down. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, now we're going to put glitter on. These are the Stila Magnificent Metals eyeshadows. You guys have to try these. This is Kit and Karma. I think the best one in my opinion. Oh, it's just too pretty. I don't even want to do it. Okay, ready? Now, the secret with these is you gotta work fast, so tap it out. Or use a brush. Oh, pretty. These are pretty. I was watching Jersey Shore today and I got inspired. If anyone knows, I'm a huge Jersey Shore fan. Like, oh my gosh. I think my favorite show that ever aired on television was Jersey Shore. That's just because we're from Jersey, but like, it was hysterical. Like, it was so funny. Ooh, this looks good. Okay, we gotta smoke out that under eye lash line. We're gonna use black. That means it's time to take a drink. That's what that means. This is a Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal Volume Mascara. Oh, I used to use that. The waterproof one. Water like 10 coats make myself at home. <laughs> We're filming a drunk makeup tutorial right now. It's me and my gal, Sam. We're a little intoxicated and we're doing our makeup. Oh, it wasn't filming! No. Okay, I'm really actually liking this makeup look. Maybe when I'm not intoxicated, it will look better. But I'm actually really liking this. Give me that highlight though. So, I know that this is a strong highlight. It's good. It's so good. And I probably should go in with the little brush, but I'm not going in with the big brush. I'm going to take this color, this pinky color on. That's the one that I have on the sparkle one. So the last one in the palette has like the most sparkle. It's good. It's so good. Ooh. So I don't have lashes. I would definitely put lashes on with this look, but I didn't bring them. So we're just going to coat it up with a little Tartus mascara from Tarte. Now I'm going over my lipstick with the Maybelline lipstick in the color 920 New Lust, just to kind of tone down that neonness. I like. That's like a favorite lipstick from Maybelline. Here is what I found. Okay, so it's an American family restaurant, and they have. Oh, you look so good on style. camera. Okay, good. I mean, you look good in person too, but 
Okay, it's a buffet style restaurant. That's what I really wanted to tell you guys because I've never been there. Oh, but it's in, North, it's in North Carolina. 9,000 employees. Do your lips. Wow. Okay. Deborah didn't like my lips as much. She thought they were too neon, so I kind of just rubbed them down and yeah. put more nude lust over top. I don't know. I've yet to I like that wear better. that, I like that lip color by itself because it's so obnoxious. I think with that kind of lip color, you have to do like all matte eyes and just browns. Like very nude. Oh, that's boring. I know, but then your lips pop. All right, Rock and Rose, we're lining. <laughs> we're overlining. Let's, let's be real. Okay, then this is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Green in Stockholm. It's okay. For this kind of look, I want like nude nude. The tea is good. Okay, and then I'm gonna pat that. Okay, and we're gonna bring it back to Jersey Shore with glossy lips. So, this is Too Faced Sweet Peach Creamy Peach Oil Lip Gloss in Peach. Wait, what is this? Peach Sickle. Maria got me this for my birthday. Peaches. All right, and I think I'm done. Jersey Shore. I love I it. What I look like. I am so back to Jersey Shore lately. I think it's because I'm tan. I did not expect this <sighs> eyeshadow to be so pigmented. I really like it, but this is a really Ooh. fall look. And I mean, but you can I get away with the lips red. warm it up though. The lips make it more summery. You can get away with wearing like reddish, burgundy, pinkish eyeshadows. I feel like in the spring still, mm -hmm. if you don't wear such a dark lip. So I think we look good. I think we look good. I definitely think like Don't at one point I was like I can't see my eyelashes and I was trying to put mascara on my bottom lashes. I definitely it got on there. Yeah, 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 wait. So okay. on a scale of one to ten, how drunk did you feel doing this? Okay, one to ten, like maybe a five. Okay, I would say like four or five too. Yeah. For me. Like it wasn't yeah. that I wasn't that drunk. Like, but I have to say, I felt the most drunk when so I did my drinking. eyeliner. Okay. When did you feel the most drunk? When I was blending my eyeshadow, the black. When I was blending the black. I, this is a lame drunk makeup challenge. I think we look great. I think we look great too. Um, I'm exhausted and I'm really tipsy, not drunk. Would definitely do this challenge again though. Mm -hmm. um, more drunk. But yeah, let us know what you guys thought in the comments down below. If you liked this video, if you liked this challenge, if you want to see it again. I thought it was fun. I thought it was really fun. I definitely would, you know, maybe even like in the summer out by the pool, like just doing more, mm. not like, I don't even like to call them drunk videos. Like right now I'm definitely not wasted. I'm like, I was tipsy. like maybe like more like a half hour ago, like when we were on the couch, we're yeah. watching Second Wives Club or something. So and I was trying to do back bends and I was trying to do push ups. Yeah, but so that's how you like know. Any fun videos, like yeah. Um, well, right now, we're gonna try to do like a fun video on Deb's channel. Um, but if there's any other like fun videos, especially makeup related, like if I, you know, if we did each other's makeup drunk, or if we did mm -hmm. our own makeup more drunk but differently, like or let us know. But, but yeah, be sure to check out Deb's video on her channel as well as in the description down below. Comment what you thought or any requests down below. Let me know if you thought this was stupid or if you want to see it again <laughs> or if you really liked it and want to see other videos. And if you did like it, be sure to subscribe to stick around for more of my videos as well as Deb's videos on her channel. And thumbs up her video. Thumbs it up if you liked it. I almost don't like this. Like, shaka bra, dude. I don't know Wait, why. this is like rock on. This is like surfs up. This is rock on. Shaka, didn't you watch Bonnie all month? Oh, I feel like I live yeah. in Hawaii too. Ha! But yeah, be sure to subscribe and stick around for other videos. And thank you guys so much for watching our ridiculousness. We will see y'all maybe in the next collab. Uh, in the oh, next one. we should. We're gonna link our very first collab together below because that was a really long time ago. She had red oh, hair. That was right I after had, you. I had, my yeah, hair. I had more blonde hair, so that's gonna be linked below. Bye, guys. Bye.